Hello everyone, my name is Maxim and today I will show you how to create morphing face for your character. But first I want to say thank you very much for all who support me. I hope you are very well and safe. Ok, let's start the video. I have creature and I need create morphing for face. For this I detach horn and eyes, but I attach this because I need move jaw. You have, I have, you have two rules. First rule, uh, when you create morphing, you can't change model. You can't collapse vertex or uh, move polygon. It's really important and. Uh, you need check all model before morphing. Also, you can't detach any part when you create morphing. And if you want to create barbon with bird, you need attach bird. And after morphing, you can detach bird because your morphing is break okay i show you how to work this so i prepare model i put pivot to zero i detach horn and eyes okay and now what i need i need export model to zbrush click to model Export model morph mesh OBG format and I need I need right name basic this is basic mesh basic export to quad done and I need export eyes oh sorry because all my mesh exporting and export eyes done okay let's go to zbrush i open zbrush and now i need import my model open subtool click to polysphere and click to import morph mesh first basic okay then append sphere and import eyes uh, I import eyes because I need uh, I need to look at this part because I create I will create close eyes okay and first i need click to basic and export and export again i show you later why i do this okay first first i start with eyes and first by morph this is uh, close eyes i click to duplicate and rename close eyes close okay now I need work with mask choose move brush and start 
start first morph You can smooth, it's not problem. Okay, it's ready. Now go to export and click close eyes. Save. Next go to basic duplicate again and rename evil browse oh, sorry browse okay and mask eyes and move browse Okay, export, now click to basic again, duplicate and write uh, set bros, set bros, work with mask and move. I'm sad. Ooh. Okay. You can move nose. And export again. Sad bros. Save. Uh, click to basic again. Duplicate and rename open mount open mount okay work with mask turn off perspective Okay, and open. And smooth. Export. Click to base, duplicate, rename, close. Close mouth. And go to again and and close. exports and finish of course you can uh, create some emotion if you want uh, for this you can download in internet 
image with emotion and use Uh, if you want, you can change face proportion, head proportion, or body proportion if you need. I show you, for example, uh, click to basic again and duplicate name. Okay, and you can move, you can move head. Don't touch this place because you you I have horns. I do this for example because you can do if you create a human character you can choose proportion skinny or fat big or small Okay, and export. Morphing uh, really cool work in Unreal Engine and Unit Engine. And you need uh, add some bonus for face. Okay, let's go to 3ds Max and continue tutorial. I go back to 3ds Max and now I need change basic mesh. Uh, don't forget I re-export my basic mesh in the brush. Okay, delete this mesh and now if you don't do this your morph maybe is not work. Okay, basic and open, import, skip, close. Puts material again, rest it form, convert to digital poly, and now I need choose morph modifier. And don't forget, you need first create morphing, then you need create skinning. Okay, click to morpher. And I need import first model with close eyes. Import. Copy name. Open. Import. <coughs> Skip. Close. Okay, and move, click to body, go to Morpher, click to right button, pick from scene, and choice close eyes mesh. And now I need 
check. Okay, it's work. Rename. Because these values import with your model in engine. You can and you you can see and change value in Unreal Engine or Unity Engine. Okay, import next mesh. I will browse, save, open, import, close. and repeat rename and and check Ooh. it's work next I will set bro First, I import all meshes for eyes and brows. Okay, now mount imports. Open mount. Okay, move. Pick to scene and rename. Hello. <coughs> Okay, close mount. Move. And rename. Uh, yes, it's work. And the last. Proportion zero one and check. It's really funny. Okay. Next, I create video how to create Epic Skeleton for version four. And one moment. If you want to create for human head, you have Joe. You need to use polygroup in ZBrush for for height and masking Joe. And now I I can delete these meshes. But first, I save. Delete. But I advise you to delete meshes uh, after skinning and rigging. And now I show you what happens if you want to fix some polygons on vertex. 
Okay. I go to Verts. And now I collapse. This vertex and this. Maybe you find hole in your meshes. And now I go back to morph and morph is broken. You can see. You can change value. And I advise you to uh, check your model before you want to create more. Okay, guys, I hope my tutorial helpful for you. Goodbye and see you later.